Welcome to ClickView Tips and Tricks. My name is Josh Good. I'm a Solutions Architect here at ClickTech. In this video, we're going to look at the Show Alternatives feature. We're all familiar with when we make selections in ClickView on a year, in a category, that we can see the green, white, and gray in action. So we can understand what's associated and what's not associated in our data. The Show Alternatives feature will give you additional pieces of information to understanding how your data is related. For example, here I've clicked on 2011 accessories and bike racks, and I can see what's associated and what's not associated. When I look up at the dates, uh, I might just assume that 2010 and 2012, there are also sales in bike racks, but since I'm selected on 2011, that's why it's grayed out. However, that's actually not the case. We had absolutely no sales of bike racks in 2010, but 2012 we did. Similarly, if I wanted to answer the question of what other accessories did I sell in 2011, I'd have to go over to Bike Racks here and unselect it. And then I can see all the accessories that we sold in 2011. The Show Alternatives feature will enable you to have that information at your fingertips without changing your selections. So we just simply go into the properties of a list box, and then in the General tab, we select the Show Alternatives checkbox. And you'll notice that up there in the dates, we now have green, gray, and we also have yellow. Same thing if I do it in the products category, show alternatives. Now I can see all the product subcategories that were sold in 2011, even though I've selected on bike racks. There's no additional setup required in the data model or anywhere else in ClickView. It's simply adding that checkbox, again, in the properties, the show alternatives checkbox. Interpreting what the yellow means uh, can be a little confusing, so we'll review that here. What the yellow is telling us is it's everything that's associated with all other selections except for the selections made on that particular field. So in other words, if I were to remove my selections in the product subcategory, then everything in yellow will turn white. It's a really powerful feature and it tells you a whole lot more information about your data However, I do recommend you keep it just for your more advanced users because see, understanding green, white, gray, and yellow can be a little overwhelming for new ClickView users. If you want to know what your alternatives are without showing your alternatives, then you can do this by understanding the sort order of the list box. So for example here, in product subcategory, you'll notice that it's sorted in alphabetical order. So we have bike racks, bike stands, bottle cages. And then as we work our way down, we get down to tires and tubes, and then we go back to B, um, bib shorts. What that tells me is everything between tires and tubes up to bike racks would turn yellow if I enable the show alternatives. And I can show you that here. If you'd like any additional information on your ClickView environment, please take a look at ClickView Community. We also have a strong partner network and our own expert services who can assist you with your deployment. Thank you.